Hi, I'm Mike, and this is Mr. Potato Synth. Okay, on the back we have a switch that controls between either a local uh, battery 9 volt power or in the down position this mini jack uh, external CV input uh, to control the unit. There's a quarter inch output with a volume control attached to that. Uh, on the top this is a momentary kill switch uh, in line of the power switch of both the battery uh, and the CV input. Um, and then that affects this knob. This is an eight position, uh, eight position rotary switch that selects between eight different capacitor values that uh, exchange a capacitor on the board, uh, the main board. Uh, that, so it gives it basically seven different dive bomb, they call it dive bomb features or functions where the power slowly drains off depending on the capacitor value. Um, there are two different oscillators. They're controlled by the two different knobs of the ear knobs. Um, there are LED indicators for each of those. It's kind of hard to see in the, the brightness in here, but uh, for each of those oscillators and then a switch to control each of those oscillators on and off and then the overall pitch of the, of the whole unit. And, okay. So both oscillators are off. So I hit, hit the momentary kill switch and it's one of the capacitor, capacitors is draining. So it's a long, slow drain. So it must be one of the higher values. So if we... Okay, so turn on and let's see.
This project is based off the Synthrotech NAND synth board. I just bought the uh, bare PCB directly from Synthrotech and then sourced all the components myself locally. Um, he has a quarter inch output, a volume control, oscillator one and oscillator two with a toggle and a pot to control the pitch of each. Uh, on each of them, the, the toggles are a double pull, double throw toggle. Half of it is wired to the board to control the pitch and the other half is wired over to this little circuit or just a couple little resistors I added uh, to control LED indicators for each oscillator. They just flash at the rate of the oscillator. Uh, and then over here, I replaced uh, ca capacitor C6. I ran that out to an eight position rotary switch, which then runs out to my little board here. My capacitor board has uh, eight different values. So this will give it um, eight different dive bomb settings, which are activated when you cut power. And then over here, along the positive power, we have a momentary push button. So as you press that, it'll slowly drain depending on which capaci uh, capacitor you're selected on. And you can also spin it and dr get different sounds as each of them drain. And then over here, we have the battery power connected to double pull, double, uh, double pull, double throw toggle switch again. And then that's connected also to a, um, a mini jack in for a CV input. So that switch selects between battery power and CV input. And then over here, finally, uh, this is the main pitch of the unit. So there's the main pitch and then each oscillator has a rate. And that's pretty much it. So now I'm going to go ahead and install it into Mr. Potato Head. Here's what it looks like inside. I got the main Synthrotech. It's a Synthrotech NAND synth board. And then up, tucked up here is the capacitor board with the eight position. It connects to the eight position rotor switch there. It's tucked up in there, and then the battery just kind of folds in there. I use uh, ribbon wire everywhere to try to keep it as tidy as possible because there is not much room in here. And, uh, that's about it. and here it is, Mr. Potato Synth. Thanks for watching. See you later.